This conference will now be recorded. So every day, you just remind me at the beginning of session. Please start recording, 7 o'clock. Otherwise, sometimes I'll forget. Usually, some people will remind for sure. Okay? <coughs> so because day one, you don't know. Uh, so from tomorrow onwards, you just uh, send a message on chatting window or just say that in the classroom people. Please start recording. Harsha, I will start. Okay, 7 o'clock onwards, we should start recording. Anyhow, so let's begin our today's session now. What is Pega and what is its real-time usage? Today, whatever that I am going to tell you is non-technical. We never use technical words. I mean, like technical way of explanation will not be there for a few days. For a few days, everything will go into <clears throat> like in our real life, real time uh, uh, perspective only. Technicals will be slowly coming. So technical terminology is important, but understanding in real life is most important. First, if you understand in real life, it is easy to learn the technology. Okay, so we will go in a real life terminology, everything. So what is Pega and what is its real time usage in industries? See. All of you here to know about this Pega, a particular thing called product called Pega. <clears throat> what is it? See here. This is the environment. I am not going to talk about anything in this environment. But Pega is a software product. Okay, it's called as tool. Pega is a software product and it is called as a tool. It is used to develop business applications. It is used to develop business applications. In your understanding, we can say simply web applications. Okay. See, like it is a full stack application development tool. It is a full stack application development tool. So, what is Pega? It is a tool used to develop business applications. Business applications. Like in your understanding, web applications. Web applications means like your phone pay. Google Pay, Amazon application, IRCTC application, the type of applications we can develop, but they mainly use for business processing. You will get a clarity on this, but if you have understood like it is used to develop some applications like Amazon, Flipkart, or IRCTC, or your phone pay, Google Pay, that is pretty much fair enough as of now. You don't need to go in depth. Okay. So Pega is a tool, it's a software product. Tool means it's a software product it's one product that has been developed software product so used to develop applications okay <coughs> so that means if you are learning pega you are going to be application developer what your role is going to be application developer suppose if you learn java you will be called as java developer if you are learning python you will be called as Python developer. You learn Java, you learn SQL, you learn uh, HTML, CSS, JavaScript. Then you will be treated as, up to some extent, you will be treated as full stack developer. Correct? So, full stack developer means mainly, primarily, you work on user interface where you will be learning HTML coding, CSS coding, JavaScript coding. And you work on business logic where you will be learning java or c sharp or python or cpp or any programming language okay first one is markup language okay html is markup language javascript is scripting language okay java is programming language Lat later one database last one is database which is a query language structured query language all this you should have a clear idea and understanding about syntaxes and how to use it and you have to come up with your own logical skills okay logic you have to implement by yourself being a full stack developer so pega is a tool used to develop business applications where it is full stack application development full stack application development what is meant by full stack application development it will you can develop ui plus business logic plus db but what is the difference so you are going to be a full stack developer by learning java with ui plus database or python with ui plus database or maybe any other combination of technologies which makes you a full stack developer then how pega is different pega doesn't need any coding does not need any coding 
there is no coding required while working with Vega. No coding means what is your understanding about coding? Anyone tell me. If when I ask you, you can unmute and respond. When I ask you, you guys can respond. I will not ask you anything which you are never aware of. I will just ask you general questions. What is your understanding about coding? Coding means writing the business logic. Many people think like writing business logic. But HTML is also coding. No coding means no HTML coding, no business logic coding, no queries, no queries. As a developer, you don't have to learn about HTML technology here. CSS, you don't have to learn. JavaScript, you don't have to learn. And you don't have to learn anything like Java, Python, or anything. You don't have to learn about SQL queries and all. So without the need of coding, you are going to develop applications, business applications. You might be wondering how is it possible? It is possible. Okay. So Pega is a user interface based tool. See, generally, if you want to create a class in Java, generally, how do you create? You will write class, class name, opening place, closer place, main method. Inside that, you write coding. Generally, I'm saying if you don't know, no problem. You might be writing or typing something. But here, <laughs> navigations you will follow. What do you follow? You will follow some navigations. You will follow a navigation to create a class. Okay. And you will provide a name of the class. Some name you will be providing here. Something like this. You will be learning all this. You don't have to much bother about what am I doing here exactly. But you need to understand one thing that without the need of writing code, you are not going to write any code. Without the need of writing any code, you are going to develop your application. Class is created. The way how you created class in Java, CPP, C Sharp, Python is completely different from Pega. Pega is a user interface based tool. Look at here now. See, I am asking you to design a user interface form, which is for customer registration purpose. What is the purpose? Customer wants to register with first name, last name, all that. Generally, what would you be doing? You are going to write HTML coding, no? Generally, HTML coding means you are going to write that input uh, tags, okay, all that. So you have to learn syntaxes, you have to remember everything. But in Pega, it is not like that. Just the navigations which I have followed is used to create user interface. Where I am going to, I want a text box. I can add text box. Text box is for what purpose? Collecting the first name of customer. Okay, like this. Collecting the first name of customer. Okay, first name of customer. Next, I want to go with the gender of the customer. Gender means I want it like a radio. So I will go and drag and drop the radio button. So here you go, gender. So gender you will be getting male, female, prefer not to see. See, the same UI you are designing by writing the code, but here you are doing it by just drag and drop. This is not only about UI. Business logic also same concept. It will be generated automatically. You don't have to learn about any syntaxes and all. Class I created. Class is part of business logic only, generally speaking. But I never written any coding. Okay. And database queries. If you want your application to interact with the database, you need to write queries generally. That is also not required. Simply speaking, not going into technical much. Simply speaking, if you are going to be a Pega developer. You don't have to write any HTML coding or you don't have to learn anything about HTML, CSS, JavaScript. You don't have to learn anything about business logic. You don't have to learn about anything about SQL queries and syntaxes. See, Pega is a no code application development tool. Pega is a no code application development tool. Application development tool. Using which you are going to develop applications where your applications going to have User interface, business logic, plus database interactions. But all of these you are going to implement as a developer, Pega developer, without the need of writing code. You don't have to write any code here. Understand clear, everyone? Are you getting the idea about what is it going to be used and how it is going to be used? If you're going to be a Pega developer, you don't have to learn anything. During our sessions, I will tell you about 
oops concepts i will tell you about just a basic sql commands that is pretty much fair enough not more than that is required you will work on database with joins also you will implement but you will not write any queries you will experience it that is the main advantage of pega is students from any education background can learn pega so pega eliminates the need to have the technical knowledge so you don't have to remember the syntaxes you don't have to think about how to implement your logic okay you have to understand this tool how to make use of this tool what are the components provided in this tool because it is a product right the product you need to learn if you are able to learn this product perfectly okay then you are going to be a good developer where you will be working as a full stack application developer without the need of coding understand clear everyone anyone has any doubts or any queries related to whatever we have discussed so far see if i come back to you and ask you about doubts or queries you should ask me doubts or questions related to only these things only these things you should not ask me sir how salesforce is different from pega the type of questions you should not ask me now that is a deviation question that is later we will discuss if required but so far do you have any question you understand it clearly respond on the charting window online students you have a facility to send a message on go to meeting charting window please respond on the charting window offline students you respond to say something everything clear or any doubt or any question everything clear online students are you clear about it every one of you should respond you understood right it's clear so so here you go now okay see then what should be your eligibility to learn pega as a student you are a graduate from b tech you are a graduate from post graduate from m, m tech might be a post graduate from mca or a degree graduate like bcom bsc or i don't know about all those things by any degree okay there are people who are mba candidates okay so in our success stories you can see we have even mba students also got jobs as freshers it is possible so when you are skillful in today's market no one is going to bother about your degrees they will bother about only your skill level they take your interview if you are pretty much good you are performing like a best technical candidate with good knowledge and all definitely they will hire you for sure okay so you don't have to have any other thought about your uh, technical background from any background you can start learning pega with zero knowledge you don't have to have knowledge anything about prior knowledge anything about any technologies you don't know c language you don't know html nothing you know about programming language still you can start learning pega from zero onwards make sense clear everyone so but only thing what is needed is you must be a dedicated student dedicated students means student should be regular to the classes you should practice daily and you should give us mock interviews complete your assignments we will not give you anything which is hard tough so whatever we discuss in the class the similar requirements will be given to you with little bit of changing so that your knowledge will get improved okay so i'll explain you that process also then know about your training process see your class timings will be 7 am ist it has today it has begun at 7 o'clock and i will close the meeting sharp 7:59 8 o'clock it will be closed at any cost remember this we want it to utilize 60 minutes properly at what time i will open the meeting daily daily timings will be same demo timings are not different from your regular classes see we have different slots available but what happens is your training duration will be 3 and 1/2 months it may increase one week more because of so many festivals from now onwards okay you will take all day no monday deepavali holiday like that so it may increase one week more than that okay but still you you will be given with the best out of best knowledge for sure where your training duration whatever that is there throughout this duration timings will never change timing 7 o'clock means it is fixed see i i have seen today many students classroom students everyone is here mostly by 7 71 okay but online i have observed whoever has connected online i have observed one thing 50% of the students online they have connected at 7 10 
probably you might be thinking like the, today is a first day he might be starting waiting for 10 minutes for some people and all that will never happen please understand that see the first thing that a student should have apart from anything else is punctuality okay every day i will open the meeting by 6 45 am means 15 minutes before the class time i will open the meeting and i will wait for all of you for 15 minutes okay by the time you come here sit relax you join the meeting and relax okay seven o'clock on dot your session will begin at any cost remember i will not even wait for one minute okay if i am not punctual how you will be if i open meeting at seven o'clock five minutes seven o'clock ten minutes every day you will not clear at what time i will come to the class okay it will never happen like this i will be available by 6 45 am 15 minutes before itself i will be in the class i will be waiting for all of you seven o'clock on dot we will start eight o'clock sharp we will close the meeting what about this 15 minutes you might have some doubts or questions that you wanted to ask me about the previous classes right that you can utilize then is it possible to cover all the doubts in in that 15 minutes no we have a separate procedure i will tell you about the doubts clarification how it will be happening later i will tell you later okay because that i cannot start now tell you so everyone clear right so duration of the course is three and a half months right during this three and a half months we will cover the theory part we will cover the technical explanation of the same concepts and real-time usage of those concepts and hands-on practical with a business scenario implemented and integrated into a project so we will start working on project from day one onwards from day one day one means not today tomorrow day after tomorrow from monday onwards we will be starting a project then what about your software installation we have already sent you the link to download the software and install it how many of you have finished it some people have finished thank you what about others you will be doing it make sure you install pega software on your laptop by end of this friday maximum okay don't start looking into it friday today itself you start doing it okay so it is mandatory that you need a laptop from next monday onwards okay so complete your installation process set up your machine we have sent you a video about the same we have shared all of you and one more thing here is all of you have received the meeting link from this number 9652532753 invite this session invite there might be people in this group who might have received the invite about the session maybe from your friends forwarded to it is it forwarded from your friends or today morning also we sent reminders right you got from this number if you have received a reminder today morning okay this is not for you for the students who doesn't have a direct communication from this number i'm talking about if any such student is there please note down this number with name harsha trainings pega and right away right away it is mandatory that you save this number why after the session is over this theory this class running notes regularly okay class running notes all that will be shared to you on your whatsapp number this will happen for first three days okay later we will create a group email group and we will share you on email google classroom some separate drive facilities there later but for first few days we don't know who is joining and who is not right all the inquired people we will share the documents that we will share only on whatsapp that to broadcast not in a group broadcast message means if you save our number in your phone let's say i have saved your number i have added into broadcast but you did not save my number even though i sent you a message you will not receive it because my number is not saved in your phone that's the reason i am requesting 9652532753 this number must be saved all in all of your phone save it just if you are receiving daily communication just morning also if you have received any gentle reminder update then just save it and leave it if you did not receive any communication from this number 
you can save it now and then send a message mention your name in place of your name you mention what have, what is your name my name is harsha you mention your name today attended demo okay today attended pega demo class pega demo class that's it simply my team i mean like admin team will be able to understand that you did not have any communication previously they will share you all the required documents what they will share you software in download and installation instructions video all that they will share you and course content they will share you and this this today's theory document is uh, class running notes document is there no this one they will share you one faq document also they will share frequently asked questions means you might have questions like sir my background is uh, like bcom background am i eligible to learn? so i have done my btech <clears throat> three years back i prepared for bank exams i was not able to crack i got a gap so guide me how can i proceed this type of questions you might have right that, that faq document contains so many questions like this that will sort out your queries and anyhow you will be talking to me later okay so look at here now so after three and a half months you will be able to work on projects independently after this three and a half months course is completed you will be in a position to work on implementing a project independently and you will get a clear idea and understanding about all technical concepts of pega and also purpose of each of the concept in real enterprise business application in the real world it's not like we do simple simple things here in the real time projects if you are going to join tcs thereafter you are working for a client called humana there will be a client enterprise application no how that enterprise application you will implement same way we will be working on here okay that means whatever you learn here it will match exactly it will match the industry standards 95 percent it will match that five percent we can never match not possible anyhow that you will be able to 95 percent whatever you learn here this will exactly match the industry standards of developing enterprise applications the tool that you use and access here no this tool is 100 out of 100 percent is same what you are going to work in real time there is no difference not even one percent difference 100 out of 100 percent this tool this navigations every component that we access everything 100 percent you will be using the same in real time and also you will be in a position to know about how to implement the practical requirement using specific technical concept if you are learning one technical concept how i can make use of this technical concept to implement different types of business requirements to implement different types of business requirements and you will be molded in such a way that as a real-time pega developer who is working on enterprise applications that's how your knowledge will be given see you don't feel like this is just a training like a pressure level or something okay if you learn here you will be equivalent to four to five years experience resource for sure and even more than that frankly speaking because while learning here i will tell you some i will ask you some questions take that question and ask someone who is working on pega since past five years definitely they will not be able to answer so but they have knowledge i'm not saying they are not knowledgeable but my point is the level of training that you will be trained on the knowledge that you will be given it is uh, equivalent to four to five years experience or resource for sure even though you are a graduate fresher still you will be learning that level so to an experienced level you will be molded but remember one thing you should be regular to the sessions and you should be practicing daily you should be giving mock interviews you will be working on assignments okay that i am going to give so daily you are going to attend the session for one hour after one hour you start your practice during the session is going on you don't have to take any notes okay so everyone clear so far every one of you whoever has connected clear right see we are going to work on 8.7 version right so it will get upgraded to the latest version is 23 23 doesn't mean that 8 after so many versions are there 8.8 8.7 after 8.8 8.8 after 23 they come up with like 23 year next year what is the version 24 after that year what is the version 
ट्वेंटी फाइव एवरी इयर फोर वर्षन विल बी रिलीज एवरी क्वार्टर वन वर्षन विल बी रिलीज अंडरस्टैंड दट सौ देंज द वर्षन नंबर वि विल बी जंपिंग आन टू अपग्रेडेड वर्षन सी इफ यू आर् लर्निंग इयर एट डाट से यू आर गोइंग टू लर्न यू शुड बी एबल टू वर्क आन सिक्स पॉइंट टू पेगा वर्षन आनवर्ड्स फ्यूचर वर्षन आलो विल बी एबल टू वर्क आन फर् श्यूर ओके ई विल इंट्रड्यूस पेगा ए आलो फ्रम दिस बैच from this batch onwards pega with ai whatever the ai they have integrated that ai integration also i will teach you for your batch understand clear okay so how many projects you are going to work on four projects you are going to work on total how many projects four projects see two projects you are going to work on parallelly okay so parallelly so parallelly you are going to work on two projects so where during the course 3.5 months 3.5 months two projects will be working that is so from monday onwards we will start working on project right that is a class work see while the project one we are going to work on i will teach you the technical concept i will explain you its real time use i will i will give you one business requirement i will i will explain the business requirement i will implement it following all the navigations you will be watching that you will be understanding grasping the knowledge i will be taking a document i will be taking a document with screenshots everything with clear written explanation and all screenshot by screenshot i will be taking that practical document anyhow i will be recording the video also so after the class is completed immediately you will receive this practical document class running notes and theory document separately also will be available that one plus video everything you will receive you revise just once go through this practical document and you start practice i'll tell you the practice methodology also learning methodology also i will tell you later okay but this is what will happen so like two weeks over from monday onwards two weeks over you start working on project to two you start working on what second project you are going to start working on okay means first to two weeks whatever you learn from day 1 to to till two weeks second project when you start you it will it will come like a repetition but that is a different project even though project is completely different domain and it looks different the implementation will match the knowledge that you have gained during first two project will help you to implement the second project on your own if you have any doubts any questions anywhere you stuck you have to get back to me okay i'll help you on that two projects over now now let's go back so here three and a half months training plus one week additionally it may it may be because of holidays and all plus 45 days i mentioned no what is this one again see here see we have introduced something called post to training program or job ready program during this three and a half months what is the level of skill that you are going to get during this 3 and 1/2 months once 3 and 1/2 months is completed if you are regular to the session if you have practiced parallelly and if you followed our process everything you will be good perfect you can crack interview you can work on project independently but still you might be little bit fearful this is one thing there will there will be little bit of fear to face the interview no so this 45 days additional training is going to let you Uh, i mean like uh, uh, is going to let us polish the polish your skill once again that means during this 45 days course we will make you to work on two projects so no technical explanation nothing it's like in a class i am telling you about one technical concept business requirement explanation and working on it right it will not be like that how it will work in real time if you join a project they will give you requirement you have to understand the requirement you have to implement it you have to present what you have done right same way the project will be given to you you work on the project yourself any doubt we will help you not technically technical knowledge is already over project wise any doubt we will help you and there will be reviews once in two days review will be there once in two days one class like this will be there one hour class where from first topic to till all the last topics we will cover all interview questions this is like a repetition for all of you interview questions because interview questions will be covered during the regular classes also but again topic wise again they will be covering 
no, we will be covering interview questions there. That 45 days training cost is additionally 20,000 rupees, actually, apart from your regular class fees. But you don't have to pay even one rupee for, for that 45 days course. You are joining this training program. You are eligible to get the 20,000 rupees of course for free of cost. When you are getting for free of cost, why do we have to mention 20,000 rupees? The case is different. That is, it is not you. Some people who are already working on Pega, some people who are from other somewhere else, they might have learned they did not get good knowledge and all, they will be joining. The reason behind introducing this post training job ready program is that one only. It's not only not for our student actually. So we have introduced this. Some people are calling us and asking us, I don't want to learn Pega from scratch. I have already learned somewhere, but I'm not up to the mark. I have watched your videos in YouTube some videos i felt like you are going too much depth than them and that is what they are asking in interviews after attending interviews i realized i was not been provided with enough knowledge so i cannot spend time of three and a half months so i want to work on a project plus i want you uh, to give interview level training so for that reason for that people only we introduced when we start this post training program we did not uh, give it for our students for first two batches post training from third batch onwards, we started thinking about why don't we polish the skill of our students also once again, allowing them for free of cost. But there is a criteria for it. It's not that everyone will be coming into the post training. It's not that everyone is not allowed. All of you, whoever joins the program are welcome. But you should have to prove yourself. That means this three and a half months you are attending the training program. no? We have mock interview process. Okay. So mock interview process will be there that you have to give regularly. Minimum six interviews you will be giving. So after interview, we will give you complete details. What is your performance? Technical performance, uh, communication skills for freshers, especially that is required to tell you about. And how you are explaining? You are theoretically good, practically good, scenario based also good or not. What is your score and all? We will give you. You have to make an average score of six overall through the six interviews. Six you have scored, you are eligible. You will be able to score it if you practice regularly. Six is very easy, actually. Okay. So it's dead easy. So that's how. Suppose after three and a half months is completed, for some reason you are not able to practice. Few of you may be not able to compete with the class. You are a little bit slow. No problem. We will give you additionally two and a half months means three and a half months is over training is over today is last day of training for example you are not ready to enter into post training because you are not ready to give the interview but you need some time we will give you two and a half months more time during this time anytime you prepare and come back to us okay you are good up to the mark you are el eligible to post training we will allow you into post training without any <coughs> payment remember this whoever is into post training indirectly that means you are in the job definitely you will be able to crack any interview okay so far whoever whatever the post training batches completed the success rate is 100 percent okay there is no doubt about it 30 students are there in post training 30 people have got jobs okay 30 means our students may be some number outsiders maybe four or five people will be there outsiders okay most of the people are our students only from there. See, like this, post to training or job ready program, whatever you call, your target should be entering that one. Okay, you might be feeling like already I am spending three and a half months. Why should I spend 45 days more? See, is it mandatory that you have to get, get into the post training? No. Three and a half months, you are perfect. You will be able to crack interviews. But why post training? I already told you at the beginning. You might be some somewhat little bit fearful. That fear also will be gone. You will gain full confidence of working on a project independently and you can crack any interview. That's how post training is going to uh, level up your skill as well as the confidence. Okay, that's why it is recommended. But taking it or not, up to you. We will not charge anything for that. Okay, from you, we will not charge. For your friend, someone else, not our student, we will charge them 20,000 okay okay so now here you go see i told you about the process so what you will be provided up during and after the course please understand this point 
three and a half months completed doesn't mean that you are not allowed to come here to the practice session you are not allowed to ask me doubts you are allowed to ask me doubts or questions anything forever no problem you can ask me doubts or anything forever after one year you come back and say that i have joined one project this is a requirement i am not getting idea i will be happy to help you okay and what you will be provided during the during and after the course daily class running notes and theory documents topic by topic look at here now pega classes theory documents are there no topic by topic theory documents are there no today this topic completed okay for example this topic completed today application topic for that i will be taking running notes this running notes i will share you plus i will share you theory document two documents will be. running notes will help you to quickly revise what has happened theory document will help you to understand everything that is covered in the class if you are if you are there in the live class you need running notes only theory document you may need it for review okay and here you go now further and practical documents with screenshots and clear written explanation will be provided i shown you already right we will be taking the practical document like this screenshot by whatever the practical will do i'll record it anyhow but screenshot by screenshot i'll be taking and giving you for reference purpose after one hour session is completed remember this during and means while the class is going on you will not do any hands on please understand class is over then you need time of one and a half hour maximum maximum initial days you need only 45 minutes 30 minutes later i am saying one and a half hour time every day unit means one hour time for attending class one and a half hour time for practice this time should be there for within every one of your schedule okay that one and a half hour you'll sit back go through the practical document revise recollect what has happened in the class and try to implement that practical after that look at here daily assignments will be there no daily assignment will will not take more than 15 minutes so i will write down the topic assignment related assignment one topic requirement i will write the requirement and give you you will be able to work on it and the same topics related interview questions i will give you these questions only they will ask you answers we will not give you you will find out easy these questions only they will ask you in your mock interview understand they may twist the question a little bit okay first one or two interviews when you attend you will get the idea about okay how they are asking entry questions and all you will get a clear idea you will be able to crack it we will help you through everything plus please make sure that you have to uh, uh, learn best because december uh, mid we have december beginning or december mid we have pressure openings especially pressure drive will be conducted okay experience day every time is there but that is a tie up actually okay already uh, last two month only right I mean, like September, September mid after 19 students got placement as a fresher. Again, next to drive will be there from another company. Uh, around 15 to 17, they need that drive will be conducted. Freshers, please be ready. But for your batch, you may not be eligible. No problem. Again, it will be there in February. Okay, by the time we finish. Okay, so please remember always anytime you may get interview, real interviews. I mean, like openings be ready all the time experience not pressure everyone okay so we'll bring the opportunity suppose a client when they ask us they will not give us time within two days they need profiles that's how they it will be so i will also ask you within two days you have to share your resume okay so here you go daily assignments of enhancement requirement plus interview questions for screening interview all this will be shared on each topic you will get interview questions apart from that interview question documents are also there we will share that and audio recordings of all topics with explanation will be shared that means okay uh, one more point i forgot practical documents after daily live session recorded video this video recording you no, know, like this your practical theory everything will be there will be provided with you view access till three and a half months plus two and a half months more okay we will extend 15 days like that additionally our intention is if you are going to join as a student here to learn we want you to finish your learning within three and a half months only okay don't uh, postpone it like i will start practice from tomorrow prior tomorrow tomorrow don't post like so you strictly set your mind that you want to learn pega at its best and you want to be regular and you want to practice regular and you want to crack the job at the earliest with that mindset you have to join that's why within the given duration you should be 
utilizing the opportunity to learn Python. So three and a half months over, still two and a half months, you will get access to the drive. View access means only you can watch anytime. No problem. Okay, it will not be there in your laptop. It will be there in our server. You can watch during this period and after that access will be gone. But do you do you feel like you want to learn for 10 months or one year? No need, right? What is your target to learn Pega and get into the job? Okay, maximum worst case, it should be six months. Worst case, it should be worst case. Okay, and interview question and answers topic wise documents will be provided. Audio recordings of all topics means there is one topic about property section flow action. Anyhow, I'll be telling you in the class and all. You want to revise to understand the topic. I have audio recordings. Everything audio recording is there. I will give you that recordings. Whenever you get some free time, suppose you are traveling to somewhere. Okay, you are in a bus or train. Okay, that audio recordings you will download. It will be there downloaded in your laptop, audio recording. And get into your phone play the topic which you want to listen like how i am explaining in the class same way i will explain after that explanation i will ask one or two questions you don't have to respond to me find out the solutions for those questions it's like a revision for you when you listen to it multiple times automatically your brain remembers it easily understand clear that's how you'll be provided you can make use of it and audio recordings and then google classroom access look at here so I'm telling you about the process we follow here. So Pega batch so and so, so and so batch is there for that batch. For your batch also, tomorrow we will create one demo. Will we will create after joining real one? We will create first few days demo. In the Google Classroom daily, we will attach the documents like this. Today document also will attach. We will give you access to this. You will go here. You will open the document and you will download the theory document. See theory plus practical documents, class notes, except video recordings, daily session. Except recording, everything else you can download and you can keep it in your only recordings only. You will be watching by following the drive access. Okay. Next, you see here YouTube channel is there. Harsha trainings pega. There are also so many interview question and answers where I have attended the interview as a candidate. That also will help you. They are not mandatory, but it will help you. And we will help you on resume preparation, model resumes we will give you. We will review your resume, interview tips and tricks, everything we will help you. Real interview audio recordings will be provided. Means you might be having some um, enthusiasm to know about how real interviews will happen, how they will ask, what questions they will ask. Around 15 companies, real interviews, real interviews, where I have attended as a candidate. Okay, that 15 companies interviews will cover everything actually. You will understand in real time how they will ask interview questions. The same way, whatever we discuss, they may twist here and there so that you will get higher. That is also audio recording. No? If you uh, after one month is completed, you can start listening to these audios, which will help you a lot to crack the real interviews. Okay. See, a lot of information is provided to you in our library. Okay. But <laughs> all this information utilizing properly is in your hands. Utilizing properly is in your hands. So please make sure you utilize it properly. That is very, very important. So daily one hour class time, daily one hour class time plus one and a half hour practice time is needed as I have already told you. Okay. So if you regularly attend the class practice, definitely you'll be in a situation to crack any interview without any help and can work on project independently without taking any help. You can crack interview. You can work on project independently. But I will be always available to guide you and assist you throughout your career. Fresher, how you should show your resume. Already working employee in IT, maybe on a different technology, how you should post your resume. Already working employee, non-IT, bank, pharmaceutical, somewhere, wanted to get into IT, how you should prepare your resume. Already a person who has gap after graduation, how you should prepare your resume. For each one of you, I will tell you a way to prepare your resume. I'll review it. After I review only, you should post the resume. Don't post your resume without my uh, review getting done. Okay, that is very, very important. But maybe if you are a manager level or you're already seven years experience in IT, you are switching technology, you are pretty much confident about everything, go ahead. I'm talking about people whoever is in need. Okay, that I will be available to do it. That we will be doing at the end of the sessions. and there I will be helping you. No worries. 
and post training or job ready program also i have explained third project fourth project all that we will be doing here the cost is 20000 rupees but it is free for our resources our students i'm sorry our students it is free and post training program eligibility give us interviews on all topics score 6 out of 10 it's it's not that you will give only one interview how many interviews you have to give interviews. step by step you give interviews that is mandatory final interview all topics you will give anyhow is it only one chance we will give you no many chances we will give it's not that only six interviews you give 10 interviews what is there we will take it no problem okay but we will take for every student students after the last date of training after the last date of training within two and a half months means today your training completed two and a half months grace period is there they should be get they should get eligibility for upcoming training program after upcoming post training program upcoming post training program after one year you come and say that i was your student one year back give me free of cost post training we will not our intention is very simple actually this post training we started with it even with a different reason that we wanted to hire resources and place them for the companies so we started it actually we were able to place five freshers and five experienced resources recession came okay then we stopped now they are not giving it for consultants because of less openings that is the open fact right all of you know this or not that is an open fact i don't have to hide anything now the openings are less in every technology of it sector okay every technology take any technology openings are less okay but this is the right time to learn and be ready okay by the time openings comes you should be ready okay so in a regular market a company will give contract to sub subcontract to vendors we started like that only but because of recession because of less openings companies are handling by themselves so many consultancies are now without any work actually okay so once the market turns back hoping for from, from jan mid after okay once us is good everywhere else it will be good okay so that time we will act as a full full time consultant and we will hire experience plus pressures and we will place them okay that's the process we follow otherwise uh, in, in this market we are placing you directly i mean like we are not going to get you our payroll okay so now you are in the post training means you are in job if you are there in the post training means you are in the job i already told this point okay so far everyone clear online students and classroom students all of you clear so today is just an informative session now. I, I just told at the very beginning, what is PEGA? What is its real time use? What did you understand? PEGA is used for application development. You can develop applications. You will be a full stack developer. You will be working on user interface, business logic and database where you will be doing everything without the need of coding. So any degree graduate, any background, technical or education, anyone with the degree, any degree, you should be able to learn PEGA for sure no need to have any technical background so after that i am giving you information about the training process and what do we provide everything i am telling you okay and see students with gap after education students who are freshers students who are working in non-it companies wanted to switch to it students who are already working in it wanted to migrate from one technology to another technology you all can learn what will be the future scope of pega this might be a question in your mind right today you are learning pega how many years it will be there in the market see generally many people have a thought like tools will come into market they go away after a few years right sap came long back no 20 years back still it is not faded away right salesforce came 20 years 25 years back it is still there no pega came 35 years back still there in the market see these tools are sustaining why between so many tools came and gone these are not a simple service related tools these are development tools means as long as full stack development is there in the market pega will be there in the market as long as java is there in the market pega will be there in the market because it is a full stack application development no development is required every time but you will develop applications within no time because you are not writing any code it will be there in the market for next to 20 years you don't have to look back for sure okay there is no it will not retire it is not java may retire pega will not retire why because pega they may redesign into python they may redesign into another technology but java may retire 
okay because of technical competition may i am not saying it is retiring okay but pega will be there for sure so i will be sharing after today's class all of you will be receiving on your whatsapp this the document you are seeing now the class running notes document in the whatsapp uh, okay group we will create not now group will be after you enroll after you enroll okay here but as of now we have a broadcast message sending you daily right so google classroom link we will share you today join that google classroom link demo link only later that also will change okay faq document i will share you like i told na, i am a graduate from other degree am i eligible to learn what are technical prerequisites and all certification related also i'll tell you after some time and my personal number is this one if you wanted to talk to me personally about your career guidance you can leave a whatsapp message on this number or you can call me but i will tell you the timing strictly follow please between 1:30 pm ist india time 1:30 pm ist to 5:30 pm ist all students from india you utilize these hours don't call me 10 o'clock 11 o'clock or after class is complete because i have multiple batches okay i'll be available between this time for sure to talk to you personally and students from usa and other countries right <clears throat> 6 pm to 6 45 pm ist or 8 30 pm to 9 30 pm ist that is your early morning time so students from india don't call me evening time i am not saying that i am not available the time duration i will give it for other country students because 1 30 pm 5 30 pm ist they will not they will not be available that is at their midnight time okay so this time students from india you call me this timings you leave it for other country students they will call me in the evening clear everyone so are you clear about what we are going to provide i will repeat once again you will be provided with class running notes theory documents practical documents daily assignments audio recordings of technical concepts audio recordings of real interviews and then practical documents with screenshot by screenshot daily class recorded video with view access interview question and answers topic wise documents also will be provided google classroom access and youtube channel see except video everything will be there with you permanently forever for your lifetime video only will have limited access but actually you don't need video practical documents screenshot by screenshot with written explanation is there no combine all screenshots together that will become a video only okay you should have to use this little bit okay combine all the screenshots that will become a video okay. everything will be there actually with you forever the only thing is you have to utilize it on time okay is it yes yes uh, can you hear me sir see practice yes i can hear you just hold on practice after the one hour of session within a day any of your free time you take one and a half hour and practice any free time you take it's not mandatory i am not going to give you a time slot all of you practice during this time slot one hour you have to attend this 7 am 8 am after that by tomorrow's class you should have some free time somewhere no practice that time and any doubts you can ask yes please go ahead you are trying to ask question yeah, you know, like, uh, what if in case like we, uh, after a few few days of our class, like we registered and we after a few days of our class, like, you know, like we couldn't make it. Like, uh, is there any chance just we can join on the next batch or something like that? Hold on, I'll tell you. Everyone, right? Okay. See, if you are a student enrolled, due to some emergency, you are not able to continue. See, we are giving you entire access to everything, right? okay video access is there you are not able to attend for five days only you will resume then no problem you go by videos and then resume you are not able to continue you will completely drop off remember this this is strict in any emergency situation you can get back to us within three days time worst case is five days means today you got emergency you're not able to tell me respond back i mean like inform me no problem see tomorrow day after tomorrow or monday tuesday wednesday thursday within five days maximum worst case any time you leave a whatsapp message okay saying that phone call is not considered 
oral communication not concerned whatsapp message only on the admin number or my number so and so is my student id we will give you student id no problem i am not able to attend the classes yesterday i did not attend day before yesterday three days i did not attend for some emergency you don't have to tell me the reason okay if this is the situation okay i may not be able to continue my classes remove my access to everything allow me to the next batch this is a proper way of informing okay i'll tell you another situation also you came back to me after 20 days you are saying that i was in emergency i did not attend last 20 days i am not able to continue we will never allow you understand it clearly why we will never allow see in any emergency situation isn't it not possible to draft a simple message in whatsapp just taking one minute time are we going to get such an emergency situation i don't even think so but this is very strict as he has asked the question i, I actually i have to tell you this but anyhow he posted the question within five days you get back to me and say or what is the reason you don't have to tell me say that i'm in emergency i may not be able to continue drop me here allow me from here onwards we will allow you two months you attended one month you attended next batch one month completed onwards we will give you we will allow you till then we will have this one month video access will be there with you you can revise no problem we will not remove that video access we will remove you from the group only access will not remove for the old one one month after we will allow you in the next batch from that topic only we will allow you understand clear everyone but after 20 days one month you come back to me and say that i was in emergency i was not able to implement i don't know the process and all that we generally considered as irresponsibility i should not use that okay but are you going to be absent for your company without informing for five days being an employee same way you should act here understand offline students can switch back to online and online students can come to offline anytime no restriction but being informed informed today i am traveling i'll not be able to come to classroom please change please give me online access for few days i'm an online student i want to attend live sessions two days in a week i want to attend live three days i will attend online being informed everything just you can utilize that feature okay it is there hybrid model you can attend no problem we will never restrict you okay it is already late eight o'clock three minutes now i know that i did not give you time to ask me any of your personal questions i know that okay but whatever i want to deliver the information today i have delivered it to you okay i am good so far you are also good up to what is been given to you if you want to ask me anything i have given you timings i have given you number also my number get back to me during that time i will be available i did not pick your call what do you do whatsapp. immediately leave a whatsapp message i will call you back no problem okay so with your available time you leave a whatsapp message i'll call you back okay we'll sort out like that we do not want to miss the communication okay already five minutes late i am closing the meeting remember this at any cost seven o'clock on dot i will open the meeting seven o'clock on dot i'll open i will start the session not meeting i'll open 15 minutes before i'll start the session i'll not wait for anyone because seven o'clock is class timing means seven o'clock only that's it it's not that five minutes i want to wait because you are stuck in traffic your internet issues and all connect 15 minutes before only leave it you do your work connect and stay on the meeting go and do your work sit at seven o'clock and then listen to the class okay last minute you don't try anything okay same meeting link you have to use for tomorrow also meeting link will not change be available to the class sharp seven o'clock like how you came today all of you came on time okay came by come here by seven sharp five minutes before only you come and sit and relax okay i'm closing the meeting already late we'll continue tomorrow with same link thank you for joining everyone